I'm Randy Sklar. I'm Jason Sklar, and this is Point Point, the only sports discussion show where everybody vehemently agrees. I do not not agree with you. Agree with that one. Now, on the show today, we're going to talk about the Westminster Kennel Club dog show, but first, some bitching of another kind. Tom Brady's girlfriend, Giselle Bunchen. Isn't it Giselle? Oh, no, Jay. It's Jizz. It is Jizz. Had some choice words for Tom Brady's receivers after the Super Bowl. She said, my husband cannot fucking throw and catch the ball at the same time. Is she right, Jay? Of course she's right, Ren. Her husband can't fucking throw the ball and catch it at the same time unless he's throwing a screen pass to himself and that would look weird. It would look weird. Here's where she's wrong, Randy. She should not be uttering that phrase anywhere in public out loud ever. Mm -mm. Problem is, she's a model. Mm. She's probably only been told she's wrong two or three times in her life. The last time being when Tom was like, hey, take your skinny ass back to Trader Joe's and get the right Luna bars. I'm a blueberry bliss man, bitch! Like MIA's middle finger, Jay, I am up and I am agreeing with you right now. Hotness on Giselle Bunchin acts like a shield against honesty. Nobody's going to tell her the truth except for us. And now Tom Brady has to clean up the mess. He's got to go all Dan Marino on his wide receivers. Wait, you're talking about buying isotoner gloves for those receivers? That's exactly what I'm talking about. Randy, like a girl in the champagne room with Tiger Woods, I am bobbing my head up and down in agreement with you. But I think Brady's got to bump it up a notch. Really? I think the guy's got to get her debarked. Really, like a dog. Yeah, cut the vocal cords. You know when a dog is debarked, yeah. they're barking, but they're going <laughs> Every time Giselle needs to say something stupid about his receivers, she's going to open her mouth, and all that's going to come out is <laughs> That's some good stuff. All right, topic number two. We're going to take this one to the Twitterverse. We got to talk about the Gronk and Gronking. Which, I think gronking is a verb now for bad white person dancing. Yeah, the gronk stance was so bad, Mark Madsen was embarrassed. A lot of people said, hey, this guy shouldn't be out celebrating. He just lost the Super Bowl. Randy, you tweeted. Taylor from the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills would have been like, you gotta take your losses harder than that. And that woman's had some loss. Let's see what you guys had to say about it. Uh, Jose Lamas, the Jose Lima of Twitter, said, Gronk is the same guy that wore a Pats helmet to the podium to shake Adele's hand on draft day. This latest isn't surprising. His point is, he never knows what to wear. Yeah, the guy's like a walking wardrobe malfunction. Right, his shirt was off, which, if your shirt's on, you can claim, all right, this was, I was pushed into it, I didn't want to be up there, but your shirt's off. No shirt, no shoes, no conscience. Let's go to the next. At JB Huskers wrote, my thoughts, who the fuck cares? He's nailing a porn star and you're not. Nailing a porn star, is that something we all want to do? I want to watch a porn star. I don't want to nail a porn star. Yeah. That is a board that has many nail holes in it already. Finally, we look ahead this weekend to the Westminster Kennel Club dog show, or as I like to call it, socially awkward people in weird slacks running next to their pets. Jason, is there too much hype surrounding this event? Yeah, there's a lot of hype around this event, and I'm sick of it. I'm honestly sick of people talking about their Westminster dog show parties. I'm sick of uh, commercials getting leaked on the internet ahead of time. I cannot go anywhere without people saying, is the deer hound, the Scottish deer hound Hickory, is she going to repeat this year? Hey, newsflash, yeah, she's going to repeat this year. Well, lock me in a bathroom and call me Mrs. Roethlisberger because I am helpless here, Jay. I have no option but to agree with you. I forced you to agree with me. When Roger Goodell is considering putting the Pro Bowl at the midpoint of the Westminster Kennel Club dog show. I call that some motherfucking puppy bowl logic, bitches. And on the issue of Hickory, you can skip that Bayless, Jay, because I completely agree with you. Hickory is definitely going to repeat. There's no way she's not going to repeat. She's added two pounds of lean muscle, and she stopped licking herself in front of mixed company. Randy, she's got the three Fs. She's focused, she's fit, and she's fixed. She's going all the way again. And that's something we can all agree on. Hickory repeating. I'm Randy Sklar. I'm Jason Sklar. And this has been Point Point. No, 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 no.